In this video, I'm going to teach you how to set trailing stop loss in TradingView. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to properly set up and use the trailing stop loss feature in TradingView. You can do it in a couple of ways. However, for this video, I'm going to showcase what I believe is the most convenient one. So if you have a broker account directly connected to TradingView, you will be able to set it up through the order panel. So go over to the order panel and in here, all that you have to do is interact with this option here, stop loss. When you choose stop loss, you will be able to take it on and then choose between stop loss or trailing stop. And as the name suggests, this second one is what you are looking for. So when placing an order, look for this option, make sure that it is set up and then choose trailing stop. Then you will be able to set up the trailing loss or trailing stops distance in takes points or a percentage. It's very important to know that the availability of this feature is highly dependent on if your broker supports it through the TradingView platform. It is also important to know the difference between the bid and offer price as trailing stops act differently depending on if you are in a long or short position. So after you set it up through this order menu, like I said, you will be able to go over here and set up the trailing stops distance in ticks, points, or a percentage. You will be able to have it set up accordingly and it will automatically go off when it reaches that specific amount. Keep in mind that for this video, I'm not going to give you detailed instructions on how to best utilize this tool, how to optimize it, and I'm not going to go too much in depth about how this works. I simply wanted to present how you can set it up to TradingView. So this is basically what I wanted to showcase. The ability to place the trailing stop order, like I said, through TradingView is entirely dependent on your broker's integration with the platform. Form. and trailing stops are a valuable tool for managing risk but they don't guarantee profit keep all of that in mind always test your trailing stop strategies in a demo account or through back testing before using them with real money i hope i was able to help you on how to set trailing stop loss in trading view if this video helped you please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips thank you for watching